Hi everybody, this is V and welcome to the Zines by V. Let me wake up my face. I am up and I didn't even think I would wake up this early, but I am up and um, we left off at yesterday, yesterday um, putting the another niche together we started off no we left off right here putting the stove together and as I was about to show you the baker's rack now I have this baker's rack many years ago but as I told you a lot of these stuff was in the garage and um, they haven't been used so now that I move into this piece I don't want to put like, um, you know, get drills and stuff and hold, not only that the ceiling is not that high enough for me to put up a, a copper, uh, a rack for, yes, we are still on the copper explosion. Boom. <laughs> We're still on the copper explosion. I mean, it hasn't exploded to its capacities yet, but it's about to be. So we left off at, oh, I don't think I've shown you this. I put up this after. This is the kettle. Again, copper. And I put out this new one. I already have another copper. Pot. But I never met a piece of copper that I didn't like. <laughs> and the one downstairs is also a whistle kettle. I might have to. Yes, I. But this one was so cheap. It was just $12. It went from, I think, $29.99 to $12. I had to. So, we're over here now. And like I said, this is the, the copper rack. And this is the rack. This is a baker's rack that I... I'm taking apart to make my um to make my copper rack. As you know, we are creators. We think of a different way to invent and to do different things with. So I already take taken um let me lower you. Already taken this piece here off the screws to it and I'm gonna put this piece to the side <sighs> we about to do the copper exposure like I can't even talk so I'm gonna first start with us I think I have to start from this end first I already like you see this rack here the next time I fully show it to you in its capacity it will have been a different color and this piece right here already unscrew it and I'm about my husband don't know yet but we about to go to the marble store because I want a piece of marble on there yes he, he doesn't know it but that's where he going so we're going to start with, look at my friends. You see my friends? <laughs> yes. So I'm going to start with this piece right here. Because I'm going to turn this into my copper rack. My copper stand into, you know, you know how we do. I... The next piece I'm going to put up is, where are you? You better not hide. Okay. I am missing a pot. Did somebody come through and take my pot? <laughs> oh, okay. I am really missing a pot. Oh, no, I'm not missing a pot. Okay, the next one I'm going to put up 
is this one here. And that's the next size. And I'm going to take you in to I'm going to take you in to show you the goodies. And a small one. So take you down a little lower my head might be cut off but it'll be worth it for the copper um the next piece I'm going to put up like I told you I already put the um the hooks on here I have some more hooks but I don't want to go searching for them this is the next piece and let me show you this here. <sighs> Look, these are chef pots. They are heavy. They're chef pots and it's in the hammered look. And I don't know what size it is. It don't have no size in the bottom. But, you know, still got to go ahead and clean them. I don't want to blind you because I still... <gasps> I love you. I don't want to blind you. And... Is the chef pot they don't come with covers but I was able from other pots that I had to um find covers for this and this this is one of the covers that I could use for it <laughs> so this one is going to go here I actually have two of this size and I'm going to take you in. Don't worry. You're going to have the copper explosion with me. Um, this is not the right hook. I have to look for the hooks that I have. Because they are better suited. They're for the pop rack. And they're better suited for it. The next piece. I'm going to put up. Is the strainer and I think this let me see. Ugh, you better fix the strainer is going to sit right. I like to give a little space, not much, just a little space because I don't like them to really like you know, I don't want them fighting when I'm not around because you know they all be fighting for my attention. <laughs> And the next piece I'm going to put up, maybe this. Maybe this one. Ugh. I need better, need to find the hooks. I didn't want to invest in hooks because I know when they were hung, I have like a copper rack with the the black hooks in there substantial enough the next piece I am going to put up I should have a hook right here because there's another piece no another piece that I could put right here and I'm gonna t you know what let me pan them forget about me look at the pots look at the pots forget about me let me see they're looking spar mm -hmm. yeah look at what I am gonna do with them and there is girl there's a story behind this one. I'ma tell you, I'ma tell you, I'ma tell you. Um, here is another one. This one came with the lid. I don't know the size of it, but it's pretty substantial. It's pretty substantial. And I'm going to have to 
Okay, let me tell you the story behind this one. Let me tell you. Okay, listen, right? Listen. You know when certain things are just meant for you? Now, I went into Marshalls many, many years ago, over eight years ago. And, um, you know, they had, was it Marshalls? One of these stores. I had Marshalls or TJ Maxx or one of these stores. I can't remember where. It was a store. But one of these type of stores. And these pots were laid out. No, you know, like, you know, my heart was going, you know, all of that stuff was happening, like, boom, boom, boom. So, I'm looking at the pot, and I'm like, golly, expensive. Very expensive. Walking by, very expensive. So, I just happened, you know, sometimes you're in the store, and you're like, no, I'm not going to get this, but I'm going to just look at it, just, you know, to touch it. I'm glad I did. And it happens to me time and time again. Like, do you do that? You go to the store and it's all of the same thing there. But you look at the price of everyone. I do that. Even clothes. Yes. So, I went looking. You know, I'm looking at the pots. And finally, my eyes laid on this one. And... It had a ticket slap across it. Mind you, I'm going to give you the backstory. All the rest said $510. Somebody slapped from the store one of the tickets on here. And this piece. Let, first, let me show you this. I'm going to get up real close. I hope I don't blind you, right? Let me find it first. It's right here. It's right here. I'm trying to bring you in a bit. This is five, one, and a zero. This was $510. So I'm picking up every one like, no, I can't afford it. Because remember, I was a single parent. My money was funny and my change, girl, I don't know where the change was. But you know when something acting funny is real scarce. So the dollars wasn't there at all. But you know, retail therapy, like you know, shopping, that don't cost. And I know I couldn't afford with no five kids. I couldn't afford no um, pop for no $510, eight, nine, ten years ago. I picked up the pot. It had a ticket slap across it. $29.99. No, I tell you the truth. What just crossed my mind? Listen. It came between maybe groceries, getting the kids some need, or I don't even know why I went to the store because the store wasn't even close to me. Those suckers wasn't going to eat that day if I had. <laughs> they better, you know how cows chew on their cup, they better do that because $29.99. Girl, all the rest was $510 and they had like different size, right? $29.99, girl, I, I can't remember if I had the script changed together, but all I know, I went straight to the register because I did not want anyone to change the price of this pot. I went, paid for the pot. I was so happy for the rest of the day. I don't even know what I ended up doing, but she stills with me. So this pot is $510.00. But I paid $29.99 plus tax, New Jersey. I have to try to show you this again. And it is right here. Right here. And it said $510. $29.99. It was meant for me. So... I'm going to put this one right here. 
I'm gonna have to double hook until I find the rest of my, oh, I didn't show you this. Lovely. If I'm in say so myself. Oh, I have another hook right here. What am I doing? So, I could put, you know, because I'm trying to stagger them. I could put one here. Put one here and put this one over here. Yes. Oh, y'all, stop fussing with each other. Stop it, children. Stop fussing with each other. All of that noise y'all making. <sighs> but give me a second. I'll be right back because I need to show you. <sighs> I'm in love. The greatest love of all of the copper girl. Hercules! Hold up, hold up, hold up. I'll come right back. I am back. I had to have a moment of silence and everything else. Because I'm finally reunited with my copper. And it feels so good. Oh my lord. I'm just in love. We've been together for so long. And I've always loved her. According to the kids, I always loved it in her. She shines so brightly. And I love all of y'all. I don't love one more than the other. But I don't want them to hear what I said. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. I love this one. This one, it costs more than the rest of them. I will not tell you the price that I pay for this one. At this time, my money has stopped being a little bit funny and my trick change wasn't so much strange anymore. When I saw this, and you know I said, I have all these, I would not buy anymore. Plus, I haven't even, I only bring up some of them from downstairs. But this one had to make an appearance. I do love this one. I'm sorry. No, I'm not. I do love this one. This is the one. You can look this one up at um, William Sonoma. And I did get it on a little bit of sale. But I just love it. I love copper. Did I tell you the first time I seen copper? I was a little girl in Grenada, St. George's Grenada, watching the Bill Cosby show. And they had this shiny object. Once I seen that, the show didn't matter anymore. I watch it for the things in the background. The Bill Cosby show. That's the first place I seen copper living in my little beautiful Grenada. And I promised myself, if I ever come to America and I have to have pots, I want pots like these. But then when I got here and I seen the price of these pots and you know, I've seen them like on tele. after a while I start seeing them on television. After I came up here, I will watch like, um, like, um, the food network and I didn't care about the food. I care about the pots. Julia Childs, she used to have these pots in her kitchen and I'm like, how can I be her friend to get to know the pots? <laughs> got to a store where they sell these pots and I was just mesmerized and then people said to me you have to be wealthy to own these pots you have to be a rich person and I said you know what if it's the last thing I do before I die I better be able to own one of these pots 
And bit by bit, I started picking up different little pieces. Here we are now. And it's still in New Jersey. At my brother's. I didn't even forget that I had it until he reminded me. Because I had stuff stolen at his house. <laughs> I have a vintage copper and leather ice bucket. I'm serious. I have a few more pieces that I haven't brought upstairs. But this one right here. I love all of y'all, and I love everybody the same, okay? Behave yourself. So, and I also found a piece. It didn't come with it, but it so happened, you know, when something is just meant for you, when it's like, you know, like your lifelong, like y'all belong together. pumpkin soup together and when I'm getting ready to make the pumpkin soup I'm gonna put like an advisory out there like the weather and I'm gonna tell y'all the ingredients so we can make it together so we can taste it together girl hold up hold up let me show you this I'm gonna finish showing you the copper but look at this look at this fabulousness this, 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 this. This is huge. So I'm going to take it back over here so I can finish showing you the copper explosion. So, how can I? I'm going to keep this here. Oh, this, this here? Girl, I didn't forget this was here. I had my son lift this up here for me. But let me take you in. I don't know if I might. This worked perfectly. I don't know if I might buy a copper wand for my new home. But for now, this worked. This worked perfect. I'm not going to do anything to you. I'm not going to get rid of you. You've been faithful to me. <laughs> So this is my KitchenAid, um, KitchenAid, um, mixer. No, I didn't forget you. And yeah, my KitchenAid mixer and it's the big one. And I might just get a couple one for just the heck of it. So I want to take you in to show you a bit of the copper explosion i have a lot more pieces downstairs but i don't want to overcrowd the kitchen which is, you can never have too much copper in your life you know like i was telling amelia you got a cold get a copper pot you stomp your toe get a copper pot whatever ailment you get get a copper pot <laughs> That's my excuse for shopping. Get a cup of pot. So let me take you down to show you a bit of the explosion. So here we are. And I wish I had more space to spread them out. But you know, this is a decent sized copper rack. And this is the look. Like I said, the next time you see this, this piece here, I would already gotten the white marble with the veining in it. And I can't, I can't, I can't. And I also have, you know, <laughs> lemonade, anyone? A cup of water, anyone? I have two of these. So this is part of 
the copper explosion. How do you like it? So I'm going to um, do the rest of the, the kitchen and then I will show you everything together. So this is it for now. Thanks for coming along with me and see the copper explosion. This right here is the uh, door to the living room and straight ahead is the dining room. Um, my son already set up the um, table in the kitchen and I'm gonna come right back. I'm gonna do a haul and you wanna see the copper? I heard you. I heard what you said. You want to see the copper one more time? I might get some more pieces. Some of the other pieces that are standing. And just put them up here. Let me see. Because I'm not going to put this on the stove. As yet. Oh, this looks cute here. You know? You know? And this piece could come right here. I might, I might bring up a few more pieces to just, listen, to just clutter the rack up. It's my birthday. It's copper day. So this is the view of part of the copper explosion. They finally are out and looking pretty 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 so like i tell you the next time i show you this which is my husband don't know yet but we going to get a piece of marble and yeah we're gonna get this marble. oh i didn't show you this there's one more thing i didn't show you in the copper explosion where is it you know what? I'm going to do a haul. And like I said, when I come back, when I um come back, I'll show you the rest of the kitchen once I put it together. And listen, love you guys for watching. Thank you so much for coming along. Oh, I can't block the copper. I can't block the copper. Come, come, girl. Get to the side. Get to the side, girl. To the side. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate every one of you thanks for putting up with me and this copper explosion and i even have one to make crepes you know when me and my husband we went to france i was all creeped out girl yes so I'm gonna let you go. I'm sorry, the video is so long, but I just had to show you the copper. Sorry. Bye bye. Love you.